Hello and welcome to another episode of Dave Flies RC. I'm David. Uh, today we're going to continue uh, on the build of our Aeronaut Triple RES 2.5 meter electric power glider. Um, due to some te technical difficulties earlier, we lost the footage of gluing together the fuselage. So I'll just fill you in. It's only just two pieces here, left and right side of the fuselage and a slight bracing. Uh, so today we're just going to continue on putting in the formers that will actually bring the two pieces of the fuselage together. So I had a bit of practice off camera to try and figure out the order and which way these goes and I've come to the conclusion that the best way to go about it is just to actually pre-assemble it off, off, the, off the model and then drop it onto the model. So I think we might just go ahead and do a little bit of gluing. Uh, we're just going to use a long lead time PVA glue. Uh, so it gives us a bit more time to actually let the gluing take place. So here we go. So this is a, just what they call Formula 3.2. I'm just going to put him in here. Now, as I said before, the uh, the manual is in German, so we've downloaded it, the English manual. So we'll see how we can get a lock from there. So here we go. So obviously I've got my manual down here. 3.2, those two together there. And then we want 3.3 going backwards. Oh, it was six. No, it was six. Into RO3 here, so just glue that with a spark of glue. So earlier on I've looked on YouTube and I actually found another another video of um, a guy Bavarian RC and he has an aeronaut triple neo um, and he's put the thematic wings on the triple neo uh, so it was, was quite a nice very nice build. So if you want to check that one out, Bavarian RC, have a look at, at his channel. It's about an hour long, but it's a very detailed building of the wings and it was a very nice job. So I'm hoping that if we can get anywhere close, anywhere close to him, we will be more than happy. All right, so we're just pre-gluing these together. And then we will hopefully drop him on and all goes well. We'll fit straight in. Thank you. 
All right. So this forms part of the cavern. All right, and those two onto there. All right. Where the glue is, you're longer here. So I've actually put a bit of grease paper down underneath the model. Hopefully, catch this, catch the glue. And hopefully this will hold a little kitten caboodle. All This is his former number seven. Let me just get him to there. Well, that was not too bad. I thought I was really going to battle. I thought I was really going to battle with that. I suppose that's only half of it. I should got to get these other bitty bits in. So this, we are doing the electrified version of this aircraft. So this will have an electric motor. So we have to actually put this extra bracing on the side over here. <laughs>
This is the next problem we had. We had a bit of trouble with this off camera, trying to get these two parts to line up. So, hoping that this time it'll go on nice and easy and not actually give us any trouble. using a pot like using a fast dry epoxy here to line this up oh there we go oh beautiful well that went a bit easier than last time Let's unpin this. So part of this stuff is we, the back half of the fuselage will be glued together later on. Get a little bit of tape. We'll just tape him. Basket oh, tape. So we will leave that overnight and come back tomorrow and make sure he's all good. So thanks for tuning in and watching. Uh, hopefully you will join us again as we continue on our, on our build of the Aeronaut Triple Res uh, with the Medic Wings. Uh, so thank you very much for watching Dave's RC and we'll see you next time. <coughs>